Welcome back to another Real Talk Reaction. This one is for The Punisher, Season 1, Episode Number 6. Yes, so we just had the first like showdown between the orange guy, whatever his Agent name is. Agent Orange. Agent Orange and uh, Castle. And I think Agent Orange came out pretty much on top, except he lost his yeah. entire crew. I mean, uh, actually, that, that was for... The, the, Dun, 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 yeah, the other guy that yeah. was in the military, he didn't know Cass was going to be but there. But now he's now very he well knows. aware. So now Agent Orange is definitely going to be on yeah. Castle's butt trying to take yep. him out as well because now especially... You got to get rid of him too because yes. he know the whole thing. He the one who shot yeah. the guy that he He could be the around. one like legitimately I'm the one that shot all these people because Agent Orange told me to. Yep. So, um, so it's about to get crazy. Yeah, I don't know where it's going from here, but it's definitely not a good look that he knows that he's alive. Yeah. So, so let's go ahead and get to it. episode number six. We'll talk more about it on the flip side. Today, people. Peace. <laughs> Same way though, yeah. Let me go and get sanitizer. Let me go get Okay, but that's now. stupid. You do the sanitizer and then you rub your hands on your dirty pants. Yeah. That's why I'm to be like this. You gotta lay down. He's, he's, you gotta lay down. You gotta listen. Hey, Gunner's dead. You're lying right to my face. I know that you stole that skateboard. Hey! 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 sister in the face? Damn! Dinesh's mother called me, and I didn't believe her till I saw it with my own eyes. Hey, stop it! Are you a bully? Now, is that what this is? This family is full of snitches and traitors! And she didn't know about me today, she'll do it tomorrow! This is what we do here! Jesus Christ. He's losing his mind. Man. Get a cup of coffee. He is going to snap. So, please, Mark, that in this encounter, I have done absolutely nothing against the law. Sir, I did not. I just saw you reach for my gun. Now you walk away. I didn't, and I have a witness. Now he gonna walk away. Yeah, he gonna push him. Yeah, now he gonna walk away. So Henderson takes a bullet to the hand. What was going to like that though? Talk all that shit. Right here. Right here. Marines never leave a man behind. And you think Castle was the other guy? Run that blood against his DNA, triple fast and quiet. You got it. Yes, the no, it's totally true. We're done here. Yeah, she's really good. She is really good. She's working on her hair. Salisbury steak. Turkey. Look at that. Look at that. What are the sandwiches that you made yesterday? Right? You cook it anyway. Stuffing, twice baked potato. Amazing. I mean, we always have a lot of people. Why do you call it twice baked potato? Because. You bake it, take it out. Extended family, you know, friends. And we were just like. And then you bake it again. So you bake it to get the potato soft. We made it. Then you take the insides out and then you add a bunch of yummy, delicious stuff to it and then you put it back in the potato. 
So that the potato boat becomes crispy, yes. but the potatoes inside yeah, are now so creamy with like sour cream yeah. and cheese and bacon. Yeah. 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 I made that before. Yeah. I made that, but I made it with shrimp. Remember the shrimp? The shrimp potatoes? was a lot. Yeah. We love it. We so loved it. If I close my eyes right now, I can. That, is, that sounds really good. So I can see it. it. I mean, get the mashed up motion. It's here. Like you know, it could I'm be coming from any direction. It's just not moving. You know, we go half and half. I'm on the turkey. Sarah does all the sides. Stuffing, twice baked potato. Amazing. <laughs> I mean, we always have a lot of people. Extended family, you know, friends, and we were just like 50-50. We, we made a good team. Okay, Castle trying to like open up and like talk about their families. Uh -huh. So your friend, um... He got some serious PTSD though. Billy. Mm. I don't know, Frank, you gotta admit this is a hell of a coincidence. Billy Rochelle's my family. Why is he calling you? That's what I'm asking, Frank. Why out of blue? Out of blue. When we have like, to admit yeah. that something I mean, might be Frank going on, Frank. Frank should totally tell him You're that right. the agent was awake. Love the scene that just cast But like, he ain't thinking about that dumb shit. And he, you don't know that he's okay, banging so her? You got no, no, but I'm going to just ask, is there anybody that could possibly know you're alive? Yes, she was alive. She literally said my name when I pulled her out of the car. Yeah, he's slow, though. Frank a little slow. military. Well, where does one find dead marines these days? Because it's not on Facebook or Tinder, I checked. Because <laughs> he's not on Facebook or Tinder, I checked. Like, and he said it so deadpan face, like... Still not getting the key. You got riding that bullshit. I know, man. I was just about to say that. <laughs> social worker. I got a social disease. <laughs> you want some penicillin for that? Where I should start. So you want well, you want to help them? I'm gonna help Frank. I can get him out of here, man. Frankly, I failed him once before. Now is my chance to make things right. I can get what his point is. Yeah, I'm pushing Kurt. Kurt getting pushed either. I mean, always. and you can tell, especially in his last session where he was all dark, like that's how you can push him out. Don't mention this to anybody though, okay, Curtis? Please just keep it to yourself. <laughs> Curtis, just don't tell nobody, please. I know he's not telling you that, but. You got some friends. Get the hell out of my house. Get the hell out of my house. Ah! Oh. She, she wants him just as bad as you do. Because he acted way too nice to everybody. Yeah, that's true. I'm just telling you. Yeah, he I don't know. way too nice. We didn't have a choice back then. Now we do. But he had military money, though. We can't. Choice is sad. I'm just saying. I'm just, I'm feeling like yeah. devil's yeah. advocate. So I keep thinking he's going to turn But he is being way too, like, to get you understanding right now. He's doing what you do best. Like, that reaction for you actually being alive is not even, like, don't put me in a fancy suit. You can wear whatever you like. Let me get you up to see, Frank. I can have you on a boat tonight. Your family's gone. But you're still my brother. Yeah, he like, I know you. get you away from here. Because I don't want you coming with me. Gotcha. I probably got something to do with you, too. See, Frank, Frank is not that good at detective shit. He's not really that good at that. With a keen eye, you know? <laughs> I mean, you could be totally wrong. You could be. You could be wrong, mind. but we know Frank is not as good as adept as to like his surroundings, right? He can hunt you down, 
But he's I mean, not he's really good. He's not like, nah, he's not a he's not a people person. So he don't understand like the like what you said, like when he asks him, is there anybody that can be like, bitch, you could have said that. Yeah. yeah you could have come on. Yeah. Or Frank, how did you not know we was recording you the whole time? I'm fucking that's how I've been finding you. But you know, it took you a long time. You okay? Yeah. I don't this whole situation. Things are it's been a little much. Yeah, I understand that. Is he trying to make him come over? I don't know what he's doing right now, but I don't Another like one. it. Okay. This is not... Another one. <laughs> like, I don't get why he's showing up. Like, what is this about? Is he trying to make him come over there? Because that would be fucking... That's it. Sure. This would be a bit much, though. I would be texting his phone right now. What the fuck are you doing? Well, in the screen. This is so accurate though. What is happening? It's like you can see any closer. Right there, yeah. <laughs> I hope you're right. Right, nigga. Suck your heart back into your chest, okay? <laughs> Suck it all back into your chest. I know it was at your feet. I know it was down at your oh, feet. Oh, look at her looking at the camera. Nigga, I ain't going over here to bang your wife. I just came over here and give you a message as well. I'm a two for guy. Aww. I didn't like it, but I like it now. That freak ain't that type of nigga. I know, well, I know that. I, I don't think he was. I think I don't think he was purposely going over to do that. But I was so scared she's gonna hit on him. Yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which she was. That's she, why she probably was. The door. She probably yeah. was. That whole but like thing he is he turned it around completely and made it more like you're good and focus on your yeah. kids and I got my own thing going on over here kind of thing. Yeah, cause that whole thing was a flirt. Oh, I knew it. I epic called it. Yeah. <sighs> what an asshole. He ain't coming. Alright, that was episode 6 of The Punisher. And okay, we got all three storylines coming to fruition right now. Yes. So you got the bad guy, bad guy that we didn't think was a bad guy, but it's a bad guy. Um, I just want to say, I have been horrible at my predictions this season. But I definitely well, we just called, But I definitely just called the Russo situation because it clicked to me in that moment that like, hold up, how did he like get this whole like business to be able to do all these things that he wants to do? Mm -hmm. And I really feel like he Agent Orange some got some got support yep. in order to do that. And that's why, and this is the life he always wanted. He mm -hmm. always wanted to have fancy suits and yep. fancy cars. And this gave him the opportunity to do that. Yep. And ultimately make sure that Agent Orange doesn't come after him. Um, <laughs> yeah. Which is crap because I hope that Castle, but like you were just saying, he doesn't read people well. Mm -hmm. Like I'm hoping he actually did read into that, and that's why he did, did. and that's why he didn't show up tonight. Yeah. Um. But if he if he does that on the next episode, I was like, I uh, I trust because he did tell Lieberman that he really did trust his best friend Bill. But if he tell me in the next episode that yeah I didn't go to that boat because I didn't really trust you. Then yeah, but he ain't gonna do that. He ain't gonna go to that boat because he really need to finish what he want to finish. That's why I right, think why right. he didn't go to that boat. Right. Not that he read Bill, he was just but like, I mean, I need if to he does read him, that would be great on Castle. Yeah, part. that'd be great, but that's not in his character right now. Right now, you're not showing me that. So yeah, and then um um I can't I can't remember the psycho military guy who just killed the other. Yeah, I mean, he liar. Had, like you can't really feel bad in that moment because that guy kind of sort of had it coming. I mean, obviously yeah. that was super extreme. But both of them crazy. But. It didn't play out in the way I thought it was because I totally yeah, I thought, thought he was yeah. going to kill Curtis. Like, I absolutely yeah, thought that's Curtis, where it was going. Or somebody, or some other terrorist. I absolutely like, thought yeah. he was going to kill Curtis. Like, yeah. holding this whole, especially w with the situation. But it kind of makes sense because he did bail you out. But now you, like. But now him. what? What does he do? Now he's going to be hunted for murder. What do yeah. he do now? I mean, I don't And even, what is his story about now? If, if, if a, not if why is, up with Why does his story, like. Where does his story kind of end up? Yeah. Like, is he, this, is is this gonna, maybe it's just like another character, just like you were saying, the the kid at the beginning of the show that was, that was just like a part for Castle to like show his like, that he yeah, has hero tendencies. Yeah. Maybe this is just a, a message as far as like PTSD and how, what happens when it's not treated yeah. or something. 
but ultimately, I don't, I don't know how this is going to tie into the rest of the story, or if this is just what it was a standalone character that's just supposed to promote this message about like what can <laughs> yeah. happen for mental yeah. issues. I mean, it could be, but at some point, I'm sure that he going to tie I feel like it should to tie Frank. together because they yeah. used to. But I don't so know much. how it's going to end up. I don't know if it's going to end up on Frank's side or if it's going to end up on Agent, Agent Orange's side. Or, so. yeah, I mean, I still think that it could culminate to something tied to Curtis specifically, but again, that wouldn't make a lot of sense as far as the storyline goes. I feel like that. I, I, I honestly don't know where they're going with this yeah. character. I can't tie yeah. the pieces together. And at the same time, what sucks is that Billy Russo turned out to be bad as we suspected. But damn, he actually is working with or for Agent Orange, which, which is not good. It's also bad because even in his uh, relationship with uh, Dina now, too, like... That's a problem because she trusts him, and he, mm -hmm. he he specifically vocalized, "I like this that you trust me in this." Yeah, he's a he's a master manipulator, yep. and he's a good liar, which yep. she already called him out yep. on. So, but we know she's really good. So at at some point, she's gonna realize you just fucking playing me too. At some point, so. it's gonna be castle talking to dina directly yeah and then figuring out all the pieces yep. around that's them, what's so. gonna happen so it's only two episodes left and man this has been a really really good season absolutely good and good uh building up to what we need to build up to which is great i'm just waiting for Lieberman to come and tell his wife that he's still alive me too that's the best that part that was a little bit like nerve-wracking for me because it's like where are they going with this yeah. but i like the way that it played out and i have to say too another great episode we had some of it last episode but another great episode of like castle opening up and it, like talking yeah he's really, he really opened it up um because i got PTSD all day i absolutely i mean that dream was horrific yeah. that nightmare let me call it what it is yeah, that all his horrific. Dream is crazy. um but i have to say too i really like one of my favorite parts of this episode is the interactions with, between him and lieberman talking about their thanksgivings i thought that was super sweet yeah. like that yeah. was just a, a really good yeah. moment um great episode i love it yeah i really did love it all right, well, look, thank you guys again for watching another Real Talk Reaction for the Punisher Season 1, Episode Number 6. And until next time, people. And we'll John Five in the air. Let's go! I got to be happy locked down. Because I'm the hardest dude in the club right now. She got to be happy locked down. Because she the better chick in the club right now. I got to be happy locked down. Because I'm the baddest chick in the club right now. Right now. Look, I'm on the guest list, walking past